this is Tabby, and welcome to episode 2 of my Let's Play on Pokemon Sword. In the last episode, I made my selection for which Pokemon I want to, to have with me. And my selection was Sobol! Oh, can I not scroll over him? Oh, did I go to the wrong thing? Oh, here we go, Pokemon. Where is he? Where is he? There he is! Look how happy he is! Isn't he so happy? Oh, can I do the thing? Can I, like, give them treats and stuff? Can I? Is that is that the thing in this game? Maybe it is. Maybe I just can't do it yet. Anyway, yeah, so uh, I did that. I defeated my rival, Hop. I met his brother, Leon, who is the undefeated champion. And oh, what's going on? Stumpy, did you hear that just now? Yes, yeah, so uh, we, we were going to go get p uh, Pokedexes uh, from the lab. The gate's open. The Wooloo that was there. Yeah, there's a Wooloo just like banging his head against the gate. And it uh, looks like he made it through. <laughs> uh, it was tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there, do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterwards. Stampy, what do you say? Uh, we've got to save it. Uh, oh yeah, of course we're going to save it. Uh, right, even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in, Stampy. Right, looks like we're putting the uh, the plan to, to get the Pokedex on hold for for now. And we're going to go in and save the uh, the sheep. Sorry, the Wooloo. The Wooloo, not the sheep. The slumbering wield. Right, I think we're going to start having our first battles against some wild Pokemon by the looks of things. That Wooloo, where do you think it got to? The fog is really coming in thick now. I think we, if uh, we don't find the Pokemon soon, it might be in trouble. All right, let's go and uh, track it down. Oh, oh I didn't think they uh, they had random battles in this uh, this game. Oh, what is this thing? Oh, wild screwort? Was that? What's this thing called? <laughs> a uh, squivet? Squ squ That's like a lot of continents in a row, like an S K W V T squivet squiv squivet squivet. Sobble, we'll use water guard against the squivet. Squivet, 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 squivet. As one of, one of these pronounce, pronunciations I've been saying must have been correct. Scrovet, squavet, squivet, squivet, squivet. Whatever it is, I defeated it. I defeated the chubby squirrel. That's what it is. <laughs> uh, I haven't got any. I haven't got to the shot. I haven't got any pokeballs yet. So like capture. Oh, da da. Oh wait wait. Oh won't let me see. Oh so if I go through here I can sneak. Ah, so maybe if I sneak through, I won't uh, won't get caught by them. Oh, do. Oh, okay. No, maybe uh, if I do sneak, I do still get caught. It is a wild rook rookity, 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 rookity. What was it? What's this thing? Uh, rookity. It looks like it's wearing a mask. Uh, all right, let's uh, go and use a a water gun. See if we uh, we can defeat it. It's good just to get a bit of a early leveling up in anyway. I mean, these are like level two Pokemon that we're going up against here. Like, I'm already getting overpowered in these games. Like, one of the things, like, the Pokemon games are so easy is usually you're, like, trying to go out of your way to not get, like, over leveled. Because if you, like, do much too much random, like, random battles, you can just end up, like, too strong for the rest of the, the game. So, like, whereas other games, you're, like, trying to, like, I need to level up to get stronger in this game. It's like... I don't want to level up too much, because otherwise the fights are all going to get too easy. <laughs> Did you hear that? Was that a Pokemon crying out, do you think? What's with this music? Listen to this. This is some really weird music. I thought that's what he was talking about. Oh, it's another Skrullvert. <laughs> Look at his, like, weird ears. Yeah, I thought that was the Pokemon crying out, but it's just the song going like... Just in the background. <laughs> Right, my uh, water gun seems to be uh, handling it okay. My water gun seems way stronger, like, even against normal type than my my pound. If I do more info, is that going to say about the moves? Ah, it is. So that's 40 power. And that always oh, just says 40 power. Okay, it just seemed to be doing, like, way more damage uh, against just like, these normal Pokemons. Come on, Stampy. That Wooloo might be in real trouble. What do you mean, come on, I would, I would be there by now, like, <laughs> I was hoping there was going to be less of this. I hate the way they just keep stopping you to tell you something. Like, why did he have to do that? And he's, like, telling me to hurry. It, like, stops me walking to talk to him. And then he runs off until I can move again. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. Uh, I think I get why this place is off limits now. 
God, it's like this terrifying place. It's like literally on my doorstep of my house. It was like 10 meters away from my house, this place. We just never like knowed anything about it. Oh, hello! You're the Pokemon from the box! What the? Lord! <laughs> Appeared. So, am I, really? I'm gonna fight this thing? This like legendary Pokemon? It's okay. I can use Growl. We'll have no problem. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're not winning this fight, guys. This might be a... This might be a, a pointless... Uh, <laughs> a pointless attack. What? The move had no effect on it. Uh, run? You can't run away for for some reason. Uh, pound? So we'll use pets. Is it going to do anything? It's just not interested, is it? It's lost an ear. It's probably from, like, waving that sword around in its mouth. Chopped its own ear off. This is the one from the, the cover, isn't it? Stampy, I can't see anything. You okay? Use water gun, because why not? I don't think it's going to do any difference anyway. No, he's totally not interested in my, uh, <laughs> my attacks, is it? He's just scrawling. Why are we attacking it? It was just chilling out here. We're like, quick, attack it. I can't see anything. Whoa. I've been weighed down by my enormous bag. I've been crushed by the weight. <laughs> Hop! Stampy! What? Lee? How did you manage to find your way here? Your, uh, your pants with direction. You always get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two, and you never showed. Of course, I came looking for both of you. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue the Wooloo. <laughs> ah, this little chap's just fine. Though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here all the same. And I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. Hmm. And, uh, and at least Wooloo's alright. Yeah, Stampy? I thought we'd had it when the weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attacked. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. And it just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass straight through it. Huh, <laughs> your moves passed right through it? So, the fearsome Pokemon they say live in the slumbering world. Are they actually illusions or something? Hmm, get strong enough and maybe you two someday could be the ones to reveal the truth. But now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with you. Even if we did get an earful from Lee, what an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the tale of my legend. What do you mean get an earful? He said you did good. He like complimented you. Despite the fact you went into the woods and fainted. <laughs> Don't forget to tell your mum we're off to Wedgehurst now. She'll uh, go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. Lee was lovely. Lee said you did good, Hop. <laughs> oh, hello guys. Right, let's go say uh, goodbye to my mum and then we'll go to the uh, professor at the, uh, the lab. Where is my mum? Well, now, isn't Sobble just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, are you? Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself something at the Pokemon Centre. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Sobble will battle to the very end for you. So don't go pushing the poor dear too hard. Mwah. And you, Sobble. You look after little Stampy. Come back to rest any time you need. After all, east or west, home is best. Right, bye mom! See you later! Off to be a Pokemon trainer! Yeah, I wanna go, I wanna get to the, um, uh, the Pokemon just to get some Pokeballs. I wanna start capturing some Pokemon. Alright, let's go and, uh, head into town. Probably, oh, don't talk to me, Hop, just let me play! <laughs> Here we go! This is quite a big step, you know? My first step towards becoming the next champion! Uh, blah 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 blah
Blah, 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 research lab. Blah, 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 let's go. Okay, let's carry on. <laughs> oh, dear. Right, looks like we, uh, we, we've we been blocked off by the Wooloos. We have to go through the uh, the long grass. Anyway, ah, so, yeah, this is how I more expected. Maybe it was just the other area where you can actually, like, see the, the Pokemon. And uh, you can choose whether you want to, to battle them or not. Or, like, try and, like, sneak past them, I guess, if you're if you're really, really speedy. Uh, so I don't have any Pokeballs yet. And as I said, I don't really care too much about leveling up, so we can just go and skip through them all if we uh, if we need to. All right, then. So apparently, I think this... Oh, this isn't the Pokemon Center, is it? I probably shouldn't have, uh, have skipped through everything you were saying. It was said, like, the one with the white ball on the, the top of it? Uh, I mean, I should have kind of looked when I was on the outside. Was it here? Ah, I think this is it. All right, here's Leon again. Well done! You reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Center. You did a far sight- Why's Charizard sneaking up on me? Far sight better than I did the first time. I'm hopeless with directions. You see- <laughs> why, why is that like a running joke that he's bad at directions? Is that gonna like really come into the plot somehow that he's bad at directions? They just keep mentioning it. Hi, I'm Leon. Despite being bad at directions, I'm a Pokemon champion. Uh, thanks for having Pokemon with you. I'm sure you're glad that I've got- I'm sure glad I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Why do they keep mentioning how bad he is at directions? Now, in we go. <laughs> if only I could find the door. Only joking. I may be bad at directions, but I'm not that bad at directions. <laughs> I've got to give it to Professor Mangolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. Baroque! <gasps> it's a corgi Pokemon. Was it called Yampa? This is the electric corgi Pokemon. Oh my god. What is it today, Leon? Uh, looking for, uh, looking for info on another never-before-seen super-strong Pokemon. I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. Oh, I want it. I want the Corgi Pokemon. Just take the Corgi Pokemon and run. We can steal it. Huh, good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. Something that I need, because I'm bad at directions. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost in the road. Stop mentioning that Leon is bad at directions. Why do they keep saying it? Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. What can I say about Sonia? Well, I like the way she cooks. She makes food for you that you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of introduction is this? Why did we forget, uh, did you forget we're rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yampa helping you out, I did too. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. And this is Stampy. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path, would ya? Oh, Yampa. I love you. I love you already. Goodbye, Yampa. Oh, I miss him already. Ah, <sighs> what does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Stop! <laughs> ah! Ah! Why is this the running joke of the game that Leon gets lost? Oh, and it looks like you got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Ah, is it the Pokemon phone? Bzzz. Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? Or was it actually a Pokemon? Because last time it was an actual Pokemon. Is it just like a flying phone now? They got a map and navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost. Stop mentioning that Leon gets lost. Why do you mean? How, how many times in this video alone has it mentioned that Leon gets lost? <laughs> oh, sorry. So tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? Uh, you bet. Well said. In that case, I'll make it so that you can use the Pokedex on your Rotom phone. You obtained a Pokedex. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my gran. Could you let my gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house along Route 2. I can do that. If I can find it, I'm as bad a direction as Leon is. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedox, yeah? Uh, I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. Oh, cheers, mate. <laughs> you put the potion in your bag's medicine pocket. It's a potion. Use it when your Pokemon HP gets low. Yes, yes, I know about potions. Knowledge is power. Yes, yes, yes. Read everything on your journey. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, random stranger who walked up to me and gave me a potion. That's not strange or weird at all. <laughs> hey, things work a little bit differently in the, uh, the Gala region. Got your Pokedex from Sonya? Then it's time for us to meet loads of Pokemon and start building up a strong team. 
but battling strong Pokemon in the world can leave your team in a bad way. Not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we've got Pokemon Centers. Luckier yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, Stampy. I bet you've never been inside one. Uh, I haven't in this game. Uh, so are they rolling the uh, the Pokemon Mart and the Pokemon Center together by the looks of things? Ah, it's the old all-in-one combo. We got we got drinks, shopping, and healing. Level with me, Stampy. Is this your first time in a Pokemon Center? Uh, no, it's not. Then I don't think you need to tell me what to do. Oh, this is good. You can skip some of the boring tutorial stuff at least. If you two kids are Pokemon trainers, uh, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Now, I'm just gonna let random strangers give them to me. Cheers, I already got them, I'm good. Blah, 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 blah. Meet you at Route 2. Alright, see you later, Hop. Why don't you hop to it? Uh, right, what's this place then? Uh, got some Pokemon questions? No! No, I don't. I don't. I don't really. I just wanted a drink or something. Can I get a drink? Can I get a drink? No, I don't. No, I don't. I don't want you to rate my nickname. I haven't even got any nicknames. Right, okay. Let's not worry about you. Uh, I don't need any healing, so let's see uh, see what, what we can buy. Uh, I want to buy a Pokeball. Can I buy a Pokeball? Why do they sell Pokeballs? Is it because the game hasn't, like, taught me how to, like, do Pokeballs yet? Right, I'll buy a single potion just because they, they asked me to. Right, I have my, my Pokemon, so Sobol is going to be absolutely fine. Uh, yeah, I, I want to get a po I want to catch a Pokemon. I want to catch my, my first Pokemon is the, the goal. All right, I need to go to Route 2. Ooh. Could do some proper shopping there, right? I haven't got much money, so I'll come back to that later. Uh, where's the map? Oh, town map over here. Uh, right. Oh, so it's, oh, route two. So just keep going up. Simple enough. I will be able to to do that. Assuming I don't get lost like Leon does. Listen, Stampy. I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon trainer now, you must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? Um. Oh no. How can I just say no? This is like you know when you're getting like. Your phone's ready to update. Do you want to update now? And you're just like, no. Like, I want to say no. Like, ask me later. Uh, the gym challenge. Gym challenge, mate. Annual competition where trainers can battle. Uh, the trick is you've got to be uh, endorsed. Uh, Lee doesn't seem to think we're up to snuff. Uh, talk to the press professor would be good. Uh, proper rivals is everything to a trainer. Makes them strong. Keep you motivated. Professor House is at the end of Route 2. Let's go there. Uh, and we can train on the way. There we go. Let's, uh, I'll try and read through quickly and just summarize for, for all of you. <laughs> like, I don't want to just skip through all of it, because I know some of you, uh, might be just listening to this rather than, like, giving it your full attention. So, uh, I don't want us to miss out on the story, but they do talk a lot. Oh, don't talk to me again, Hop. Literally, you spoke to me five seconds ago. Over here, Stampy. <laughs> uh, alright, Stampy. Uh, time we filled in the teams for a bit. Ah, oh, they're gonna teach us how to capture. And I'm here to teach you how. You'll need to catch Pokemon. Lee, where did you come from? Every Pokemon has a type or two, uh, which can make it good against some opponents, but poor against others. That's the reason you'll want to catch different Pokemon to cover one other's weaknesses. Now, let's have a champion time, and I'll show you how it's done! Right, looks like we're we're catching a, another Wooloo. Tell you what, let me uh, skip through all of this training stuff, because you've probably seen this all before, uh, until we can get to a point where I can actually capture my first Pokemon. Okay, we got through the uh, the tutorial, and Leon gave me like 20 Pokeballs. So let's go catch- oh, what's this thing? Oh, it's just a fox! Right, let's see if I can capture my first Pokemon. A, uh, Nickit. Let's see if I can Nickit. <laughs> oh, very fancy Pokemon. Uh, it's level 5. I th I'm worried if I do a water gun, am I gonna want- actually, if I do a water gun, I reckon it's gonna have just a tiny bit of health left, if I get this right. Okay, oh no, it's actually uh, stronger than I expected. Oh, what's its tail? What is that thing? Ugh! <laughs> that is um, quite the uh, quite the growth you've got on the uh, the back of your tail there. It looks like it- oh, it'd be so good for cleaning. Just have that thing wander around your house, do a few tail whips. Oh, that'll clean it up. Lovely, look at that! It's made, look, look, you see all the grass around me? It's just completely cleared all the grass around it. Right, I got 20 Pokeballs. Hopefully it's damaged uh, enough. Uh, no, I don't want to use that. Uh, oh, I have to just go to the side. Okay. Oh, I got 25 Pokeballs. All right, let's go for a, a capture. And let's see if we can uh, we can grab it. I think I might have had those Pokeballs on me already. I didn't realize that I just had to scroll through my bag. Have I got it? Easy! Gotcha! Nickit was caught. Uh, what, what am I going to call this thing? What am I going to call it? <laughs> Nickit's a bit of a rubbish name. Like, Sobol I like. I didn't want to give it a, a name. But I do tend to give nicknames to my Pokemon. I know not everyone likes to give the nicknames. Um, but I kind of do. Um, I'm just, I'm just gonna, should I just call it like, like the, uh, should I call it Sweep? Sweep's a pretty cute name. And, uh, like, 
it um is pretty good because it's gonna like sweep up the floor with its giant tail. There we go. I have captured a, a sweep. Sweep has been added to my party. I have two Pokemon now. Jolly good. The adventure is looking good already. And oh look, I can see the uh the Pokemon um um professor's like giant house down the end of the the road. So yeah, that's our next goal. That's where we're gonna be heading. But sadly, we are not gonna be heading there in this video because uh we're run out of time. I'm afraid we do have time for a little. Let's keep spinning until I absolutely end the uh, the video. That would be a new tradition. Anyway. So, if you didn't see the last episode, I'm not going to be doing any more videos like this, just because this game is so, 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 so long. It'd be like a million episodes, and it would take me like two years to get through the whole game. So instead, I'm going to do some longer live streams. So uh, basically, I'll just keep on playing through the, the game during the live stream. If you can watch it live, you can join in, and you can kind of like suggest things to me, and tell me which Pokemon to capture, and names and stuff. If you can't watch live, no panics, uh, because they're all going to be up as VODs on the, the channel. So you can basically just watch through them like this video, but like as just a really long video that you can kind of just stop and start watching whenever you uh, you want. So basically, a lot more Pokemon is going to be coming soon on the, the channel. But for now, and I thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the live streams. Bye!